everyone, it's Tilly Claire and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm actually going to do a photo shoot and a YouTube video with Sev's Pics, but I have a little bit of extra time, so I thought I'd show you guys what is in my bag that I take with me to all of my model shoots. So, let's get into it. So obviously every shoot that you go to is going to be different, they're going to have different themes, different styles. So for example, the shoot that I'm going to today, we're doing three different looks. So we're going to be doing a street look, a fitness look, and also a um, pretty fashion look. So obviously this is my fitness look, so I'm going in it. But I also have two other sets of outfits along with um, different cosmetics for those outfits, um, different jewelry, different bags, different shoes. So all of that has to fit in my bag. Alright, so I'm going to go through each individual thing in my bag and why I use it or why I think it's important for me to bring. <laughs> so the first thing that I usually always bring with me to shoots is a bottle of water and a snack. Um, typically, depending on the shoot, but definitely for fitness and bikini shoots, I tend not to eat until the shoot because I will be bloated. So I always have a snack for me for as soon as I'm done and water is so super duper important. Um, I, I'm constantly sipping water throughout my video shoots. So both of these are important. All right, so next we actually have the makeup. So a lot of shoots will have your own makeup artist and they will be worried about your touch-ups, doing your makeup, you know, maintaining all of it, um, but if you don't actually have a makeup person with you on the shoot, you're going to have to bring your own and do your own beforehand. So I've obviously done mine today, um, so I will be bringing with me my makeup kit. So I've got some makeup wipes in case anything goes wrong. I've got some eyeshadows um, that I use for practically everything, and then I've got my normal makeup bag. So in this bag is sort of everything that I would need, my mascara, eyeliner, concealer, everything. So if we're changing looks or um, my makeup gets smudged, I can do sort of retouching as we go. Alrighty, so next in my bag for this shoot, I have all the extra little bits. Um, so I have um, this gorgeous belt that is going to go with one of my outfits. I have um, three different sets of sunnies, just in case it's really sunny and I want to try these out. Um, I also always bring along with me a bag sort of like this and in this has all of the jewelry that I'm going to use for different sets. Um, obviously I bring extra jewelry as well because sometimes different sets, um, you know, the photographer might not like the jewelry you've brought or it might not sort of suit the image as much as they wanted if you haven't discussed it beforehand. So I'll bring little extra bits with me just in case. Um, another key thing that I also always leave in this bag so I can find it easy is um, some eye drops. So if you're doing your own makeup, it's not so much of a problem, but if someone is doing your makeup, there has been a few times that I've gone to shoots where the makeup artist has accidentally gotten some mascara in my eye or I've rubbed my eye and got mascara in it and then I've got red eyes and then you're kind of stuck. Um, so I always sort of lean on the side of caution and I always bring eye drops with me just because I don't want to go into a shoot that I've paid money for with red eyes. I know photographers can edit things but no one is that good. <laughs> so yeah, that's something I always sort of recommend. It's a bit weird but I have sensitive eyes so I kind of need to. So the final sort of main thing that I have in my bag that isn't the clothes or the shoes is um, I've got one my mind map. So this is typically something that you and the photographer before the shoot will talk about. Um, it's sort of themes of the shoot. Um, if you're doing a video like I am today, what you're going to be talking about, what you want to get B-roll of, um, all those kinds of things and some other potential ideas. So if you have extra time, you can do some extra things, take some extra photos. So this is always important. I always bring it with me as well to sort of remind us if we're midway through a shoot. And also so that I think we're both on the same page and if I want to make any notes about future shoots, I can make them in the moment. Another important thing is I always bring my chargers. So if I'm bringing my phone or my camera or um, any other gear, I will always bring the chargers just because some of these shoots do go long. You never know what's going to happen and it's always good to have extra charging things available if you need them. So the final thing that I have in my bag are obviously my clothes. So for this shoot, one of the outfits is going to be a pink dress, 
Um, to match it, I am wearing nude heels and I'm also bringing along a pink bow bag. So this is the outfit that I throw all together. Obviously I have the belt and I have the um, jewelry as well that will all sort of tie in together. Um, but normally I try to, if I can, put them in a package somehow so they're all stuck together so you don't forget bits or lose bits. Another important thing that I sort of forgot to mention that I think every girl always brings with her is I always bring a lip balm um, and also a moisturizer. So if I'm doing a shoot that is a bikini shoot or I'm going to be showing my legs that I know are typically dry, I'll also bring a moisturizer so I can make sure that they don't look dry in the shots. Um, and lip balm, as always, I just always need lip balm on me. <laughs> So I'm going to show you guys what it looks like sort of spread out on the floor so you can sort of get a general gist of how much stuff I really do bring with me to a shoot. Alrighty, so that's it for today. I know this was a super short video, but I just thought I'd show you guys what I normally bring with me to shoots. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to let me know in the comments below. I'm more than willing to help out. Um, if you'd like to help me out and support, please make sure you click the like button and the subscribe button and you will be notified of any videos that come out. Obviously, I have some exciting ones coming up with Sev's picks soon. Um, so yeah, if you have the little notification thing on, you will know when it comes live. I hope you guys enjoyed this and let me know if you want any more videos like this. Have a good day, everyone. Bye!